Ladies and gentlemen, dear guests and participants of this Ikea Naval Conference, on behalf of the Copenhagen City Council, I welcome you all warmly. It's a great pleasure and honor for us to be the hosting city for your conference. Here in Copenhagen, we have 20 public libraries. Two of them actually opened within the last year. And they are all essential cultural institutions because they are used as open and democratic meeting places all over our city for all our inhabitants. Every single one of them is important as public institutions which bring knowledge, entertainment and learning to our citizens. I believe that our libraries make Copenhagen stronger and a better place to live. We constantly try to develop new ways of being an open, creative and attractive city. That's what we're working on and that is our goal. As an example, I can tell you that we are now developing initiatives that are making it possible for our citizens to use our libraries when they want to, not just to, during the ordinary opening hours. We are giving them the key to their libraries and making it possible for them to come and go in some new extended libraries opening hours from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. Well, actually, they don't get a real key, but they have the library card and a code. And in this digitized world, uh, it's easy for them to open the door to the library, also when there are no librarians at work. Our libraries in Copenhagen, oh sorry, is already in function. And the vision is that each area of our city should have at least one library with long opening hours. Our libraries here in Copenhagen are trying hard to develop and create new ways of ensuring attractive services in all the new media environments. And they are absorbing all the best new technology and tendencies that are relevant. All because the new possibilities are becoming increasingly useful for a future library. Being more and more digitized in a new media environment is of course a challenge for both the users and the libraries. We might have to educate some of our customers first, if you want them to, uh, to be capable of using all the new self-service and online solutions. We will for sure have to help the 20% of the population who possess either very little IT qualification or none at all. We will have to act democratic and open some doors to let them in and be part of the new way of thinking libraries. It could be help to download an ebook or simply using our online reservation services, or it could be starting up a new tablet that they've just bought. The 100% digital library is an application for tablets where we offer the very best online resources. They may be used day and night, independent of place and circumstances. The aim is to be there for our customers in a dynamic, inviting and inspiring way online. But we have also begun working on our libraries, the actual buildings, so that all the digital possibilities will be re reflected in the physical libraries. We are experimenting in, in establishing new digital areas in between all the other things, such as, still the main thing in the library, uh, the books. We all want the best access to all kinds of information. Also, whenever we go to a public library here in Copenhagen. And I hope that your conference would help us in getting better doing that. And I really hope that this conference will help us make better libraries because the role for our libraries and their current e-challenges is so important to 
find out what to do and to discuss how to make them better. I want to thank everyone who made this conference possible. I want to thank the Danish Library Association, who together with, with the Vida and the Danish Agency for Culture, and supported by the other Danish library organizations and members of the Library Umbrella in Denmark, have made this. I know it takes hours of organizing, planning, working and networking to make a conference like this. And I hope that you will all have some very interesting and good days here and that you will also take the time and opportunity to enjoy what wonderful Copenhagen has to offer its visitors. And I have a small suggestion if you have some spare time. You could visit the Copenhagen Main Library. It's a beautiful building. I wish you all a pleasant conference with lots of the good debates and constructive new initiative for the benefits of all our libraries and of course all the citizens and users. After all, it's their libraries. Thank you for your time and attention. Have a good